Ernie is a gift from God, and I'm not even kidding. Ernie is a beautiful human being. He is Tito's best friend in the store, and he, he works for him. And I hope audiences really get a chance to get to know Ernie because he came into my life personally at the very best time because I had been doing some movies that were action-driven, that were all about plot, and here was a chance to really portray someone that was essentially pure humanity, just a real human being, three-dimensional, and just a big ball of light and love. And I needed in my life to play someone that life-affirming. And if there's a God, he owes me! I don't know nobody! In fact, like in the I go home now. You want to do it right. You know, you're playing someone that's mentally disabled and you want to be true to what that is. And you want to be respectful of that community. And I did my research. I contacted people in various non-for-profit groups and asked for their input on how to portray someone who's mentally disabled. And our writer, Carlos, has a brother in real life who is mentally disabled. And so I was constantly asking Carlos, like, how would Ernie say this? And he was endlessly supportive. Derek Velez Padres is the guy you want to look out for. No matter who you ask, it's the same thing. He's crazy. But it's the craziness of passion. It's the craziness of a guy who's been busting his ass his whole life and finally has had the opportunity to put together a project that he really believes in. And when you are working with a director who really is that invested in doing something special, I'm getting a little, you know, I, I really am glad that I worked with Derek. I'm proud of him. I'm proud of what he's achieved with this project, and he, you're going to feel Derek in every frame of this movie. You're going to feel his passion, because it's, it's absolutely boundless, and he did a terrific job. Luis Antonio Ramos, let me tell you something about this guy. He gave absolutely everything he could to this project and you're gonna see that he carried the performance of I think his personal lifetime I think for Luis and I've seen his work like you're gonna really care about this man's journey don't start to me like that bro I could hurt you so you got scared huh? what you wasting so much time for what do you want what do you want to do I'm scared of you. and you know every week you know you, you go through the papers and you try to figure out okay if it's raining, where am I gonna take my kid? Like, like, we've been to the museums. I wanna take her to a movie that she can really get into and enjoy. And thank God it's the miracle of Spanish Harlem because this is a movie that everyone in the family is gonna be able to be invested in, enjoy, and you can bring your kid and you can walk away feeling good.